get your drink, get your juice, cause it's gonna be a very, very, not really long. I hope it's not long. So I first started around seventh grade. That is about like ninth grade in America. And um, so you know, um, in Jamaica people use. WhatsApp a lot, so we had a WhatsApp group, and we had a WhatsApp group um like about three days after, like they deleted the WhatsApp group or whatever. Like when the WhatsApp group gets boring, they just delete that and it just they just make a next one. So now we're stuck in the WhatsApp group, blah blah blah, meeting everyone. And everybody in there was like teenagers, you know, no adults. And then they deleted the WhatsApp group because you know people had school and whatever, so it was boring. So now, you remember what it's showing? So now, um, like three days after this dude um texts me and he's like, hey, hey um, let's call him Tom. Hey, I'm Tom, and I'm from um, the WhatsApp group, so-and-so. And I'm like, Tom, from so-and-so, like, I don't remember any person, you know, naming Tom in the group. So now, so, I was like, uh, okay. so I'm just new to this, um, like, talking to boys thing, so, I was about like 13, 12, 13, 12, yeah, um, during those times, and <clears throat> so he asked me, um, how old are you, and I was like, um, 12, I just got the option right there, and then he said, 19. So I'm like 19 white in the group and then they're like oh my friend let me call you brother okay fine once people know it in the group it's safe talk to boys whatever so I keep on buying 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 me for about like two months and then after two months now um he was like, hey, um, I want to meet you, um, but I, oh, yeah, before that, he, like the day before, um, I asked him, like, what is his Facebook, so, because Facebook was like the bomb that come from sign, but he, it's not now, and he told me, blah, blah, my name is Tom, stress such, blah, blah, on Facebook, but when, no, um, his name on Facebook was like Stefan something something. So I went on it and I'm like, okay. And he's like, I'm um, just using my uncle's account. I'm looking at me. Um, I don't really have my uncle's account because I don't want to have a wife or whatever. So then now, uh, um, so he said he wanted to meet me, blah blah. blah. So um, as I said before, he said he was 19, and I was like, "You're 19, you're not supposed to be talking to me." And but I just he keep on bothering me, and I was first time talking to him, so I just keep on talking to him. And then he said he wanted to meet me, blah blah. Then I was asking him more questions, so I. Like, what? He said he worked in the military and uh, I was like, oh, okay, you work in the military. So now um, he said that he drove a BMW. So, um, being there at 19 like okay you must be rich or something 
So I look on Facebook now and he he um he has like a BMW but it's like as I said already he said that he's it is his uncle at home. So um it's like this man told him this like this this being the best I'm like oh it must be his uncle goes inside of the car that he has so now do that now after that now um so it was like around exam time or like in June so we have like um days off to study and also um exam finish early in the morning so one day I come fish early in the morning and he texted me um, early in the morning and he was like um, um can you meet me like um at what is it again what's place um um Bolivar Plaza or something like Bolivar Plaza I don't know that and then now uh, I look up on Google map and then I was like okay yeah yeah so he was like um um, don't wear a uniform because I don't want any person seeing me and he wants just like carry clothes and change and like at first I didn't agree with it and he's like yeah just do that blah blah just um just carry the clothes it would be nothing big so I'm like okay you're like why like is it going like where does he was People, he doesn't want people from the military seeing him and it together, blah blah. But it wasn't a relationship, okay? It was just top top. But I just want to see him in person. So now, um, um, I, like a change. And I had on my school bag, and he texted me and he's like, um, I'm coming from, I'm coming from, um, Otrius, so it's gonna take a long time. But, um, yeah, I'll be in the middle of that. So I changed and I waited, and then now, so he's like texting me constantly. So I'm like, how can you text while you're driving? And he's like, um, there's this thing in um, the BMW where I just put, hook up the phone, hook up the phone, um, and I can just text with, and I just talk, and it just write down. I'm like, oh cool, I never heard of, yeah, I heard about it, but like only like rich rich people have it, so he must be like rich rich. And then, um, like, it was getting late, and I was like, where are you? And like, oh, my car broke down, I have to drop it down the road. Um, I would just walk and come um, meet you. So, I was expecting him to be me, but he said that the car broke down, so he had to cancel the, um, what's it called again? Call it, carry to the mechanics. So he um he said he was on his way, so I'm like nervous because I'm in clothes. I'm not supposed to be in clothes, I'm supposed to be in uniform, but I just want to see him so I just changed and went to the bathroom and changed and whatever. So I was standing outside with my backpack on and then I saw someone coming and then now he texted me and said I am coming. So um I'm looking, I'm looking, I'm looking because the picture um, on his WhatsApp is like this cool, nice boy, whatever. So I'm like, okay, um, yeah, so if a nice boy, so he must be like one of those rich niggas or whatever, with cool hair or whatever. When this, when I was like leaning on the pool and waiting on him to come, this nigga came beside me and like he are you there so I'm like yes I am there and he was like um yeah I am Tom um so it was kind of awkward because I said like um um are you his uncle or because the picture the person that I actually see me like that's what I saw on on his uncle account. But but 
more weird. Um, so I was So now, um, he said that I am Tom, and he said, I'm sorry for lying to you, and blah, blah. So, um, first of all, I was like, hold up. So, um, it was getting late. And I said, how old are you? And he's like, I'm 35, blah, blah. And I'm like, you're 35, and you're what's it called now, picking feelings for me or whatever because his takes were like leaning towards me and touching but like mm, I'll keep you near the side because I don't know you, I've never seen you in person and you just pop up in the group and thought that like, you have a number blah 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 so um I I was I was so frustrated it was getting lame so I went back into the mall and changed and put on my uniform and went back home this nigga was still outside like hey Zaya, let's talk to us, you know, you still can be with me. I'm like, you're 35 nigga. Easy yourself. I'm just 12. I'm go I'm I'm going to the bus stop now. And this nigga is like, um, I'm gonna I'm gonna um carry you home because you don't have any I don't think you have any money to to um to um to go home and I'm like Yes, I do have money to go home. I don't have money to go home. And he's like, I carry my BMW, blah, blah, blah. And I'm like, no. I took a bus to go home. And this thing I keep on texting me. You know, whatever. And then, um, two days later, my friend, he's a boy, he texted me. I was like, um, hey, is there, um, have you seen this guy that named Tom texted me? I'm like, Yes, he texted me and actually met him in person and he is 35 years old and then he said, um, I lend up my phone to like call a friend or whatever. Hello. I lend up my phone to call my call a friend or whatever and this nigga took in about to my phone and I'm just like, I believe that he was in the group and to process it now to a show called Catfish it's like the same thing and I'm like I I I really did not expect this um really and truly so I had to cut off this guy. I had to um obviously I had to cut off off because this nigga is a pedophile. Um he keep on texting me, I rejected his calls, I blocked him, I um yeah, I blocked him. Yeah I was him my Facebook everything and, and my friend was telling me that he doesn't have a BMW he's just posing beside of his his friend car and he doesn't work in the military he actually works as a security guard and uh, for such but if they, um, I was attracted to the BMW or, or because he worked in the military I just he was like a nice person but to know that it I, did, I didn't know what kind of intention this nigga had towards me. When I saw him, I was like panicking. I just had to have a lot of questions like, how did you know me? Stuff like that. Um, yeah. So now this nigga is part of my life. And this is 2015. And this happened a long time ago. But I just, I'm just like, you know, like when you reflect on your life, I'm just reflecting and I'm just like, I also just tell the story and just get my mind off school, which is like tomorrow. <sighs> Anyways, if you like this video, make sure to give this a big thumbs up. 
also comment down below your video requests and your feedback of the video and also i want to have a q a so also comment down below your questions and follow um, follow all my social medias below and subscribe to hands and kiss family because i make videos every single sunday 9 30 a.m sharp and Any love to the camp to my exo fam. Love you so much and I'll see you in the next video. Bye!